The current state of Tang Nano 9K platform. So the current uh, examples uh, support LCD and uh, uh, sound sound output and uh, microphone and TM uh, uh, 1638 module with uh, with LED uh, buttons and seven segment display. So now. Uh, you can run example in VS Code or you can run example in Midnight Commander. If you run uh, examples in VS Code, you need to uh, open the cloned uh, basics, graphics, music directory and uh, uh, like open terminal. Then you do CD into labs and then you run scripts. So, for instance, uh, in order to run Synthesis, you run script 03. Uh, and while while it's running, you can see, yeah, so, so this already run uh, open FPGA loader to configure FPGA for this static image. Now we can modify this example and uh, add some movement to VGA image. So let's comment out static pattern and let's uncomment dynamic pattern. So here we just add counters to uh, X and Y coordinates and compute colors based on these counters so now you can synthesize it again Okay, and now we get some patterns moving. Yeah, now, uh, so for those who prefer use uh, uh, Midnight Commander, we can use uh, Midnight Commander and just run scripts from here. So uh, in addition to 03 scripts, there is a script configure FPGA, so you just configure without running synthesis. Yeah, it runs very fast. Now you can also run GUI for FPGA synthesis, in which case it runs uh, Govin uh, GUI or Govin ID, and you can look into schematic viewer and you can see schematics of this design. Okay, uh, and you can also see reports. So it shows uh, project, uh, it shows like project report, process, hierarchy, synthesis report. So, so, so you can add, it runs synthesis, yeah. So, so you can run synthesis in a GUI and then you can see reports here. Now you can also choose another FPGA board. So uh, it shows many of FPGA boards and you need to, uh, to uh, enter a number. So this particular configuration now called uh, Tang Nano 9K LCD and has number 49, but we are going to probably change the name to Tang Nano 9K and rename old Tang Nano 9K to Tang Nano 9K VGA. So you can put 49 here. Then, uh, then it's going to ask whether you want to create a projects file for GUI for all projects. We, we can answer 
am no because we are going to use scripts for everywhere. There are also scripts to uh, to run uh, ASIC synthesis, which is uh, open lane, but uh, uh, not all examples are compatible with those scripts because you need to specify floor plan and you need to be compatible with Yosis, which is not uh, the case for all examples. Uh, now uh, we also support Govin toolchain with Yosis. So now uh, uh, let's look to uh, example with a microphone. So example with microphone, note recognition and music recognition. So uh, I already synthesized, so we need to just configure with a microphone. And uh, here is a microphone. Woo! And you can sync to this microphone note and it will recognize note. Yeah, okay. Now, uh, example with uh, sound synthesis is uh, I2S synthesizer. And I also synthesized it already. So now you can hear from this earbud. Okay, so you can synthesize the notes, or you can size, uh, you can play melody. So let's configure and play melody. Yeah. Uh, now one one neat feature is that uh, yeah you have example with a. Uh, 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 with a uh, like uh, subset of RISC V processor CPU, but this is like probably topic of uh, separate uh, 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 video. Yeah. So what uh, what you can add is you can add some uh, 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 encoder. So this one. And you can add distance uh, distance measure. So this uh, this device. So uh, this uh, this device requires uh, only two pins. Uh, this is called this is a rotary encoder or something. So this uh, uh, this uses only two pins, pin A and B, and this one uses uh, three pins. So uh, in uh, ten nano. 9k configuration we are using there are three free gpio pins left so it's a pin here here and here so three pins here can be used for additional devices and some student can connect this distance measure or rotary encoder to those pins yeah, uh, like other than those three pins, most pins are occupied. So we occupied pins for microphone and for ATM1638 and for sound output and some other pins conflict with, uh, with the LCD pins. So for microphone, we are actually uh, using uh, uh, card reader pins. And for sound output, we are actually using um uh, 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 that one uh, pins for additional one inch uh, spi display which is not here there are also some pins uh, uh, in this side of the board but unfortunately those pins are 1.8 volts so we cannot use them for 3.3 uh, devices yeah this is like uh, pretty much it yeah we also have a uh, module for DVI so the next step would be to add the DVI and like uh, uh, add output to uh, HDMI display yeah uh, and uh, finally uh, last but not least 
uh, one of uh, one of the most important exercises are exercises with like microarchitecture, for example, with a uh, FIFOS. So you can see how FIFO work on the seven segment display. So you synthesize. Yeah, so you can see that now FIFO is empty. And then we add, ah, uh, this is actually different demo. This demo shows how to FIFO arrays with pointer. So let me show you another demo. Little bit more basic. Yeah, you can do you can do everything in VS Code. So many students prefer VS Code, but in VS Code you need to open uh, directory with the examples, and then uh, you need to uh, to. Uh, open terminal and cd to the appropriate place and then run uh, scripts from there okay so here is our fifo so right now fifo is empty so by pressing button you can add some new numbers to the fifo and then we can pop numbers from here and if we add uh, eight numbers which is the FIFO full capacity, FIFO is going to be full. So you can see with dots that FIFO is full. And now you can pop. You can actually push and pop at the same time. In which case it behaves uh, somewhat similar to shift register. Also, it's not shift register because we are moving pointers instead of data. Yeah, so, so we can use this uh, setup for both uh, to demonstrate some basic uh, digital logic and uh, uh, the combination and sequential and to uh, demonstrate some microarchitecture like uh, pipelines, uh, five for queues, and to demonstrate integration with the peripherals, with the microphone and with sound output, and to uh, uh, demonstrate a simple uh, CPU, which is school risk five uh, CPU, which is just like uh, 300 lines of very low code. Yeah, and the same uh, uh, same setup works on uh, like uh, 30 something or 40 something boards already from Altera, from Xilinx, uh, from uh, Govin from Lattice uh, and from uh, uh, Phoenix. Yeah, I, I think this is uh, pr pretty much it. Yeah, thank you.